Well, Adam, as the school prepares to close, students and staff telling uh, News 9 this is not what they want Daniel Webster to be remembered for. Now, nearly 25 police officers from the Nashua Police Department were called to this game yesterday afternoon. Police say Daniel Webster player Marquise Cadill punched a player of the opposing team and then proceeded to stomp his opponent when he was on the ground. Now, he is facing multiple charges, including second-degree assault and a woman who was also also arrested for interfering when an officer tried to place Cadill under arrest. Another Daniel Webster player was arrested for enticing an already hostile crowd. Now the game was called off shortly after police were able to get a handle on things. We had one detail officer up there, Officer uh, John Hannigan. Ended up being a fight breaking out during the game. Um, the crowd and the players um, kind of uh, made it a more hostile situation than it needed to be uh, right away. So Officer Hannigan called for more units uh, for backup. And now the school has issued a statement on this incident writing, quote, Daniel Webster College's primary concern is the safety of our students, staff and guests. The behavior at last night's game does not reflect the values and standards of sportsmanship we expect from student athletes. Now, Nashua police say no officers or spectators were injured in this brawl. They say the student on the opposing team, Southern Vermont, who was hit was only had minor injuries. We're in Nashua. I'm Tim Callery, WMUR News 9.